Hi, and welcome to Dan's How To's. I'm Dan. Uh, today's lesson is going to be extremely short because I'm just going to show you guys something real fast. Um, it's going to be a, like how to change your IP. Uh, your IP address is kind of like a house address, except it's for your computer, and the street is the internet. Um, it like the the reason why you would change your IP is maybe because a site has blocked your IP address. Uh, so like things like Mega Video and things like that. Um, if you watch more than uh, seventy five minutes of video, then they do block your IP for a certain amount of time. And to get around that, uh, basically all you have to do is change your IP, and it's like that for uh, things like rapid share limits, you know, IP bans on websites, you know, stuff like that. Uh, it's really good for uh, Ventrilo servers too. If you're into um, harassing and trolling Ventrilo servers. Um, then if you get banned, all you have to do is just change your IP and you hop back in and you get back into it. Um, so I'm going to, uh, start up a web browser here. I use Google Chrome. Uh, you can use anything really. And this is extremely simple. Basically, um, you have, uh, your, you need your, uh, router's address. So mine is 192.168.0.1. Uh, and I've got a D-Link DIR615 router, but I mean, they're really all similar. If you just Google your, um, your router... Uh, you, you could probably easily find it. Um, so then you go here. Uh, for a lot of routers, the username is just admin and then just no password, but it might be different for you, so you might want to look into that before you do it. Um, then you got like a bunch of uh, options here. Uh, every single page is different, but they're all, they all got pretty much a, the same layout. You got um, your advanced options, your tools, your, your status stuff. Then you got a bunch of stuff on the side, maybe. Uh, so you're going to want to look at... Um, the status area and you got all your information here uh, so yeah what you do is basically like it should be really simple you just click disconnect and then connect back again and uh, see now it's establishing so it's just reconnecting itself sometimes it takes a while yeah there you go so now my IP has changed uh, there's also a really easy way to do this uh, if you don't want to do all that. It's just unplug your router and plug it right back in. Wait a couple seconds and boom, you should be back on the internet and with a different IP address.